Uh, finally, the Halloween decorations have been cleaned up. Happy Thanksgiving! Matt, you will clean this up this instant. So, Alfor, are you doing the cooking? Uh, cooking? No one is going to have time for cooking when we have... You know what. I know what. You can't be more specific, man. Oh, never mind. It is too dangerous to be spoken of here. Now pick up these leaves. Nah, man, we need to put more down. Oh yeah, you or Thais is gonna need to do the cooking because I invited some friends over. Matt, no. Uh, Matt, yes. <sighs> if you're not going to do the cooking, then I will. No, no, no. You are not allowed to cook after last year. We can't move to a different country again. Well, the guests are probably gonna be here in like a few minutes. And we have no food. First of all, how would we even have time to cook a full meal in a few minutes? Secondly, who did you invite? Alfor and I are your only friends because you annoy everyone so much. Oh, I better go get some ice for that burn. Well, I'll let you guys figure out what to do. I'm gonna watch a six hour vine compilation. See you guys. No, you're not. You started this, now you finish it. You and Pumpkin see if you can find any food around the barn. Thace, you and I should get to decorating. Hey, Pumpkin, you smell anything good? Boof, boof, boof. Matthew Holt, what are you doing here? You and your team are supposed to be at headquarters for debriefing. Oh, silly pumpkin, that isn't food, that's Adam! I do believe that you need to hurry. Adam? Matt, if you quote that stupid vine one more time, I will slap you. Adam! It's Wednesday, my dudes. First of all, I warned you. Second of all, it's Thursday. Well, you should know by now. If you tell me not to do something, I'm going to do it. That's just the way I was born. I can't change it. Oh, by the way, have you seen any food around here? Days and Alfor said I had to find some food for Thanksgiving, and so far, Pumpkin and I have only found you. To be honest, we've gotten pretty distracted along our way. It all started when we ran into a, this, this vicious beaver. Oh no, it's gonna be another one of his long stories. I do have to say, we did a pretty good job. I agree. Finally, Matt. What took you so long? It's a long story that I told Adam in great detail. Oh, I also got food. I promised him food if he'd shut up. <laughs> yep. Oh, it looks like the guests are arriving. Hey guys. Hey Matt. You purposefully told Adam that really long story to get the food, didn't you? Oh, yes, I did. <laughs> You're a smart one, Matt. Why, thank you. Uh, hello, Quinn. Uh, hi, Alfor. Um, uh, how are you? Uh, I, I'm doing great. H how are you? Uh, I'm good. Thanks for asking. Uh, that, that's good. Oh, Quinn and Alfor sitting in a tree. K-I-S-S. -S. 
Ow. Okay, this got awkward fast. I'll leave you two lovebirds alone, I suppose. Well, I do suppose it did get pretty awkward fast. Yes, yes it did. Well, Matt, this has actually turned out to be a great Thanksgiving after all. Oh, yes, I knew it would. Oh, give me one sec. I need to show Adam something before he leaves. Adam! What is it, Matt? I have to get back to my mission. Yeah, yeah, one sec. I just need to show you a video. Adam! You're probably wondering who are these handsome horses running around doing weird things and being awesome. Soon we'll figure out. I hope you enjoyed this episode of the adventures of the triple agents. Keep an eye out for the next one. If you want to know when it comes out, just hit that big red subscribe button. Leave a like if you love me, which you should, because I'm Matt, master. Everyone loves me. It's just, I was just born being so lovable. Well, it's Matt signing off.